Good morning, everyone. This is 6.30 a.m. Central Standard Time, like I'm on a radio station. <laughs> What's going on, everyone? This is Sweet Wills. This video here, I'm going to be talking about... Um, this video was actually inspired by a post that I comment up under on Facebook. It was a um, young lady. She made a post saying, okay, I see they got a Father's Day pen, but where's the Mother's Day pen? And I had comment up under her post saying, it's about time they start showing some love, something like that. They start recognizing Father's Day. And it wasn't no jab to what she was saying. I get what she was saying. She was like, okay, y'all did a Father's Day pen. Why, how come y'all didn't do the Mother's Day pen? So I get what she was saying. She wasn't being mean or nasty about it either. And what I was saying was, it's about time, you know, like somebody realized, hey, Father's Day does exist. It shouldn't be no different than Mother's Day, but it is. And that is the most underrated and overshadowed, open air quotes, holiday. It really is, okay? Now, let me just tell you from my experience with Mother's Day and Father's Day, okay? Mother's Day, you know, everybody go all out. We, everybody do everything. Father's Day is like, eh, yeah, whatever. And then... Some women, they get to celebrate both days. So I remember it was a few years ago I was at work, and I remember it was Father's Day. And somebody told this guy, hey, happy Father's Day. And I remember two women actually saying, happy Father's Day to me too because I'm the mother and the father. But you know the crazy thing about those two women? One of them was still with the guy. I, I, I need to figure, I should, ask, I should be asking questions. You still in a relationship with him. You still talking about you, the mother and the father. And the other one, the guy is in the daughter life. I'm not understanding. And these are facts. This is not something I know. No, I know because I've conversated with them. So I knew that one of them was still with him. So I didn't get it. But still, that's the holiday where a woman can be the mother and the father. And let me just tell you something about Father's Day. You all, I know we when it comes to Mother's Day, we hear about single mothers they have to do everything. There are single fathers out there, okay? May not be as many as you all think, but there are single fathers out there getting up every day, taking care of the kids, combing hair, feeding them, clothing them, getting out there working two or three jobs. They might they might be in school. The only thing is we don't hear too much about it, but they are out there, all right? So shout out to all the single fathers out there that's getting up every day, doing what you got to do and taking care of your kids, whether your kids... Uh, with you or not, if you got to go to work, paying child support, giving money, doing whatever you need to do. I want to tell you all, keep doing what you all doing, okay? All right? Keep getting up every day. Keep striving for the best. Keep being in your children's life. Whether you have to see them every day, picking up a phone call always works. If you got to call them every day at a certain time of day, I'm, I'm sure that your daughter or your sons or however many kids you got are probably happy to hear from dad. Probably looking at the phone. Dad posted me. Dad is like 10 seconds late. Somebody, is he okay? You know, so also to the fathers that aren't single and with them or their significant others, you all keep doing what you do. You know, and don't be, you know, I know when Father's Day come around, you're not going to get the big balloons. You're going to get the typical stuff that you normally get from grandma on Christmas. You're going to get a pack of underwear. You're going to get a pack of shirts, some socks. And I think they get that to y'all because they feel like, I'm going to tell you something. I don't know what's going on, but I can't, I don't know the last time I seen a man in the underwear section. And I think while grandma was doing that, because my grandma used to get that to her son. She used to get him underwear, socks, and T-shirts every year. So I think that's the only time they had that stuff. <laughs> I think they wore everything she gave them, like, um, in the year. She wore, they, they had to. They had to wear that, like, every year. They, they, I never seen them go to the store. Let me stop playing. I know some of y'all be going all out. I didn't see a couple of YouTube videos where folks have reached out. And I mean, when it came to the Father's Day, they did a lot of stuff for male role models in their life, whether it be your football coach, your next door neighbor, your your dad, your stepdad, your granddad. I mean, I've seen videos where folks just went all out, like buying cars and stuff. So, I mean, I'm not a dude, but, you know, when I can get some grandkids, I, you know, grandma, baby, grandma. I'm going to come up with an old sad story to try to get me a car. I'm going to, grandma ain't just been riding the bus all year. I took your mommy and your, your, and your, and your uncle to school and in the pouring rain. It was cold out there. But, grandma, what you want? Just a G-Wagon Mercedes. 
But I just want to um say that, and that just brought things up. Like my dad, even if like my dad, he'd be like, "What's going on, young lady?" I'd be like, "Happy Father's Day, I appreciate it." I'd be like, "You want something?" He'd be like, "No, nah, no, nah, I'm good, I'm good, I'm good, straight." Even if they, yo, dad, even if they tell you don't want something, they really want something, okay? They just ain't going to say it. So do what my grandma used to do. Go buy them a pack of socks. Buy them something that they normally wouldn't buy themselves. And I think that's what the pack of socks and the underwear and the t-shirts come in. Also cologne. Like, men like that. Like, my dad, like, I'll go get him some cologne. Oh, yeah. And he got to the point where he, oh, this is what you give me every year? Yeah, every year I get this stuff. Still wear it, talk crap, but wear it. Oh, you going to give me this stuff? I already, like, he already know what I'm going to get. So, but I think, yeah. So, I just wanted to put that out there. I don't want to get too deep into it because I can get rid. Listen. Now, as far as them not making the Mother's Day pin this year, I actually have no clue. I'm not big in the pin game, so I'm still, you know, I still have to look online and search just to see if any pin that they do release come out now. But let me tell you something. If Disney decides to make a pin right now, it's going to have to be a belated Mother's Day pin. Now, I don't know if y'all want a pin like that that got belated Mother's Day on it. So, what I'm going to need everybody to do is just contact Disney, kind of like let them know that, hey, we didn't get a pin this year, and see if they can put something into the works for next year, all right? Because I, that's the only pin I can see them making. I mean, I understand a lot of folks are a little, little tight behind it, but I'm sure there's a reason on why they didn't do it, or maybe they forgot to, or maybe they just didn't do it. But, you know, it's Father's Day, right? Okay, everyone, so that'll do it for my video. I know this was supposed to be about the Father's Day pin, but it went ahead and took a life of its own, all right? But personally, from Sweet Wheels, I want to wish all the fathers out there a happy Father's Day. And I... Forgot the date, but don't worry. My dad will remind me, oh, yeah, oh, your father's day. What you going to give me? So he going to tell me. So he he going to stay on top of that. And when they going to pass this next stimulus bill, okay? I got stuff I got to get. <laughs> also, um, for the the mothers out there that, you know, weren't too happy about them not doing a Mother's Day gift. I mean, a Mother's Day pin. Y'all might need to get it on Disney in on Instagram or social media or something so they can make sure next year they, they stay on top of it, all right? And like always, everyone, if you had not subscribed, definitely go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Like, share, and comment, okay? And until next time, take care.